In this short video, we're going to show you how to access and adjust some of the audio settings on the Meridian Ellipse streaming speaker using the Meridian Control app. All of the default settings on the Ellipse have been chosen so that the product sounds great straight out the box. However, there are easy to use settings which let you tailor the sound to suit your personal preferences as well as optimizing performance for the room and the location within the room. We've created another video which shows you how to get up and running with the Meridian app. So please watch this to get the most out of your ellipse. When you run the app, it will list your ellipse as available for control, as shown here. If you have other network connected Meridian products, they will also appear on this list. Otherwise, just the ellipse will appear on its own. Tap on the entry for Ellipse to access the control options. There are three alternative screen views available when using the app to control Ellipse. Each view offers different features. Tapping on the three icons at the bottom of the screen switches between these options. Here, you can see that the control screen is deliberately quite minimal offering basic controls such as volume adjustments, the level indication, a mute button, source selection, and an on-off button. This video highlights the menus view, where you can gain access to audio adjustment controls. Most of us are familiar with treble and bass controls, but it's worth knowing that their implementation here uses sophisticated DSP, so you can tailor the tonal balance of the sound without introducing unwanted artifacts or distortion. Image focus is one of the 12 unique Meridian technologies employed within the Ellipse. Eight of these DSP-based features works in the background, improving the sound without any input from the user. However, there are four technologies that you can access and adjust using the Meridian app. Image focus is used to compensate for when you're listening from a position which is off-center from the speaker. By applying a combination of carefully calculated delays and level adjustments, image focus shifts the sonic image so that the realistic sound stage can still be heard even when you're not directly in front of the lips. As you may know, bass frequencies are boosted when sound reflects off walls and any other flat surfaces which are close to a speaker. FreeQ allows you to compensate for this by letting you choose between four frequency profiles created for different scenarios where the ellipse might be located. These are for use in free space, near any wall, or on a shelf, or close to a corner. Base and space is an extremely important technology for the ellipse. It adjusts the perceived width of the sound stage while ensuring the base output from the speaker is optimized. By default, the maximum setting is applied. This gives the widest and biggest sound, and it tends to be the preferred option. However, as with the other audio settings, there are no hard or fast rules for what should be used. Personal tastes differ, as do installation situations. This is why these settings are user adjustable, and the really handy thing is that they can be adjusted while you're actually listening to music. Image elevation helps match the perceived height of the ellipse's sound image to the height of the listener. For example, if the ellipse is used on a low countertop or table, image elevation can be adjusted to lift the image so it seems to originate from somewhere above the speaker. As stated previously, all other default settings on the ellipse have been chosen so that the product sounds great straight out of the box. However, the audio controls we've talked about here are to allow you to achieve the best possible audio performance from the speaker. You can experiment, find the sound you prefer, and maximize the enjoyment you get from your music. We hope you found this video useful. Please check out the other videos in this series for more advice on getting the most from the Meridian Ellipse.